decorating with water. Today we are talking all about how to use the water element when you're decorating your space. What's up, beautiful people? Welcome back to Crystal TV, where today we are on our final video of the Decorating with Feng Shui, with the Feng Shui Elements series. Today we are talking all about decorating with water. Water is the source of all life. It is synonymous with wealth, abundance and fluidity and it's very important when you're decorating with water to make sure that the water is clear and flowing at all times if you allow the water to get stagnant it's the energy that it's giving off very much like dead wood energy is kind of a swamp water energy and not something that you want in your space when it comes to decorating with water water is probably the easiest element to decorate with and most people's go-to is an aquarium it's quick it's pretty simple it's very obvious but it's not an option for everyone so let's talk about a few others like water fountains now water fountains are very very specific in that if you're gonna use a water fountain in decorating with feng shui you want to be sure that you're using a metal fountain and not a ceramic fountain when it comes to the cycle of the elements metal is supportive of water ceramic kills the water so you want to never use ceramic water fountains when decorating only use the metal you can also use glass bowls of any type glass is a water element i mean it's made from sand and any of the watery features <laughs> like sand seashells coral, any of those things that are associated with the water would be water element decorative items. And since glass is made from sand, it falls into the category of a water element. And as we learned in, a, in the previous video, mirrors are also included as a water element because these days they're made out of glass rather than metal as they were in ancient times. You can use the water element itself, although it can get messy, or you could just use a glass vase like this one and fill it with blue, blue beads or those glass marbles, the blue glass marbles to represent the water. The colors blue and black are water colors along with fluid shapes you can also use in decorating. You can also try colored glass as long as it's in blue or black. Water is by far the easiest of the five elements to use in decorating. But let me know what questions you have about decorating with water. Leave me a comment below. While you're down there, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a single video and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.